initiative of the Government of India to celebrate and commemorate 75 years of progressive independent India. Through Azadi Ka Amrit Mahasso, India is celebrating the glorious history of its people, culture, and achievements. It is an embodiment of all that is progressive about India's social culture, political, and economic identity. The official journey of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahasso was started on 12th March 2021 from Sabarmati Ashram when Honorable Prime Minister flagged off a 75-week long festival to commemorate 75 years of India's independence. This started a 75-week countdown to the 75th anniversary of Independence Day and will end post a year on 15th August 2023. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahasav is dedicated to the people of India who have not only been instrumental in bringing India far evolutionary journey, but also hold within them the power and potential to enable the vision of Honorable Prime Minister to activate India 2.0, which is filled by the spirit of Atam Nirbhar Bharat. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahasav festival celebrates the rapid strides that India has taken in the past 75 years. This festival encourages us to rediscover our hidden strengths and prompts us to take sincere, synergetic action to regain our rightful place in the Committee of Nations. Events organized by the Institute today are part of iconic events week celebration by the Ministry of Corporate Affairs to commemorate 75 years of India's independence. On this auspicious occasion, when the Institute is celebrating Radhika Amrit Mahasa by organizing the events across the nation, it is a great honor that CMA celebrates 2022 of the Institute is going to be released at the hands of the Honorable Minister today, making it a historic day. CMA Syllabus 2022 has been designed as a robust, industry-relevant, and future-ready curriculum aligned with the global trends. It is for the overall development of the today's student to the tomorrow's CMA professionals who will lead the entities across all industry sectors as well as for the practitioners who will provide management and audit expertise to all such sectors. As a long-term vision of the Institute and professional social responsibility towards the society and being an organization under the admin control of the Ministry of Corporate Affairs, the Institute need to ensure that the students pursuing the CMA course should possess the, and acquire the robust employability skills to cope with the global challenges and become a future-ready professional. Hence, the Institute has introduced a mandatory SAP finance power user training and certification, Microsoft Office training and certification, Cambridge University Press soft skill training and certification, and e-filing training and certification as a bouquet of world-class employability and technical skills training facilities for the students. With the introduction of world-class skill training facilities coupled with the rich international level curriculum and the methodology, industry recognized robust practical training scheme and the high standard online examination systems, the CMA course is now really going global and students completing the course will come out with flying colors to grab enormous employable and professional opportunities across the globe. With these words, uh, I conclude with the thanks to the Honorable Minister for honoring us with his gracious presence today. Thank you, thank you all.